Right, CSU cam right now. Take a look at this. Oh man, this earlier sunset. I'm loving it during this five o'clock show. We get the most beautiful shots here. Clear skies. We've had some high wispy clouds throughout the day. That's about it. Weather wise, it's just been a gorgeous just for some reason. I just can't believe it's November and I think it's been this weather pattern. I mean, honestly, it doesn't feel like Thanksgiving's in a couple weeks. The weather pattern certainly not helping. We've had temperatures today well into the 60s. Look at downtown in Akron right now, 67, 68 respectively. We've got 50s, a little bit cooler out in the country, but overall a beautiful afternoon. The wind is doing its work coming out of the south. That's blowing that warmer air in here. As we mentioned at the top of the broadcast, there's very low relative humidity, so things can burn quickly. Fire can spread quickly, so keep that in mind if you're planning on maybe a Wednesday evening bonfire or you know a burn barrel, anything like that. Let's not do that tonight as we've got very dry air in place. Warmer air still off towards the west. 80 St. Louis, Little Rock, Little Rock sitting at 81 right now. All that flowing off towards the north. We've got another day of warmth. Here are your changes though. Pierre sitting at 32 degrees. It gets colder as you get up towards Montana. That cold air is not far off, but for tonight, not quite as cool. South wind should do its work. We'll be in the 40s, I think, overnight. Shouldn't have any 30s on the big board as we're becoming a little bit more milder out ahead of that next front. Tropical storm Nicole, we've been tracking this over the next couple of days. It's going to be a pretty decent storm for Florida. Jason was showing you some of that storm surge that they're expecting along the coast. Lots of heavy rain. This is going to be a quick mover, though, as it heads off towards the north. We're talking. Yeah, low pressure heading up the eastern seaboard that will bring heavy rain along its path and the models have changed and kept it a little bit closer to us. Now we were calling for rain, but now it looks like heavy rain. We'll explain in a second. No problems tomorrow with your National Design Mart hour by hour forecast up near 70. The breeze will be picking up throughout the day. Some high clouds late in the day. Just gorgeous. Again, plenty of warm air, cold air not far off. We're waiting on this system. This will come out into the plains. That brings us our colder air Friday night into Saturday. But until then, not doing too bad. All right, National Design Mart hour by hour forecast. Here's our warm breeze. Notice we've got lots of sunshine tomorrow, as mentioned, up near 70. But here comes the rain from Nicole. I know we've been in a drought, but the remnants of Nicole are going to come up here and rescue us in terms of that drought that we've been in in a big way. So Friday morning, here we go, 6 a.m., 7 a.m., rain starting to come in from Nicole, and it'll be heavy when it hits. Look at this throughout the day, just a soaker, a washout of a midday Friday. That continues through afternoon. I know there's high school football playoffs going on Friday night. Looks like wet fields as of now. If we can get this out of here, we should dry up for that, but it's going to be blustery and cold. How much rain are we talking? Maybe an inch, two, maybe three, depending on where this banding sets up. There will be a sharp line between lots of rain and not a lot of rain. Does this shift east or west? We still have to keep that in mind over the next day or so. And then after that, we turn cold. We'll talk more about this in the next half hour, but yeah, the lake effect snow will be back in the forecast, not just this weekend. Next week looks very active and a little wintry as well. Union Home Mortgage seven day forecast. The downfall in temps happens Friday night to Saturday. There's next week looking in the 40s for now, but again, just beyond that, we've got more cold air in sight. Certainly will feel like November. Please get outside and enjoy tomorrow. Yeah, you better because it looks like it's going away fast. And by the way, when you're done, you have a very nice filet mignon waiting for you. Um, Christy told me she's going to cook it up medium, so I hope you like it medium. <laughs> I appreciate that. Uh, I'm a vegan, so have fun. Oh, oh, no, oh, I forgot about that. Is he really? He is. Oh, you yeah. are? A convenient vegan. Selectively, as he calls it. yeah. I'll yeah. eat the steak. It's fine.